Hello, hello, hello. It's another wonderful Thursday evening. Perfect day to be playing some more Twilight Princess. Yeah, last time we got through all of the introduction bits and got up to the Forest Temple. So hopefully from this point on, if it's like any other Zelda game, the amount of dialogue should drop dramatically. Yeah, so let's uh, go ahead and get going. We switch on over. Where am I? There I am. The rest of my costume got here before me. Alright. Sword guy, that's us. Good old sword guy. Alright. Yeah. 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 Can I please hit the bat? All right. Oh no, it's a plant. Oh no, it's dead. Hi, Mr. Picabon. How's it going? Boop, boop. You're free, monkey. I don't love how the spiders just ignore it. Hey, that's the monkey that stole your, your lantern. Doesn't it look like she's beckoning you? Aren't you the popular one? <laughs> we have a plan to take care of. <laughs> you can't get me, spiders. I got a fling shot. Yes, monkey. Oh. Did not mean to pull slingshot out. Yes, yeah, squeak, 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 squeak. Such squeaky monkey. Oh no, it's big spooter. What, what do I do? Milk's gone. Can I can I finish? I'm I'm pushing the button and nothing is occurring. some kind of altar? Wait, why am I asking you? How would you know? Oh, you know. Yep. Well, let's go ahead and light them.
Ah, yes. The rickety bridge in the windy room. The most trustworthy of allies. How dare you show me your butt? Oh, what's going on? Has there, has there been a monkey fight? Oh no, now we can't go any further. We may as well go back. I don't know what's going on, but it seems like she wants to take you somewhere. Maybe you should just follow her. <sighs> Yeah, yeah, let's go, monkey. Monkey! Let's try that again. As I said, monkey! Open the door, sword guy. Hey. Ah, I see. These are my... I'm not big enough to have... You know, adult bombs yet. Ah! Holy shit! Phew, out at last. Gracious, once I got in there, I couldn't squeeze back out. Yes, please go back in. You were a big help, thanks. I've been looking for something in here, you see? Gracious, yes. You must need something here, too. Shall we try working together for a while, fellow adventurer? I can even warp you out of here if you want to leave. You'll be able to come back to the same room anytime you want. I can be quite helpful, you see. I don't think it'd be as a burden. Let, now let's get started. I was. How should this be pronounced? Uku. O o k k k o. Anyway. Call her in a dungeon, she will let you out and allow you to return when you want. <coughs> set, set her to use her with the buttons. Yeah, yeah, bomb bug. I mean, it makes sense I should be able to slash away spider webs, but... I get it. They, they needed the lantern to be useful. Yes, monkey. Okay, there's a spooter. Uh, well, it's... Yep. Good spider, everyone. Monkey. Don't have a key, monkey. Do you see a key? Like, monkey, I don't know what to tell you. If I was supposed to have a key already, I most certainly don't. You have not led me to the path with a key. Perhaps there is key to be found this way? Are you a key? It sure is. Thank you. 
but come on, what the fuck game? You tell me to follow the monkey, and then the monkey's not even gonna lead me down the right path. Yeah, you didn't know that there was a key in there, did you, you stupid monkey? Oh good, there's another stupid monkey in here. S monkey. Oh no, the bridge. How terrible. Come on. Fall down. Yeah, they're, they're real good fighters. I can understand why people are afraid of them. Yep. And now we have the power of two monkeys. Yeah, someone go ahead and start counting how many times I fucking roll into a door instead of, you know, opening it. Hmm. All right, they're not here yet. Was there anything you guys could do for me in this room? I don't actually, I don't think so, because that was, yeah. Let's head back, because they're clearly not gonna help me get this, because this is something I need the boomerang for. And I do not have the Boomer Dang yet. Add another to the counter. Yep, yep. Monkey. Congratulations, monkey. Thank you, double monkey. That. Oh, I see. No, bad. Bad duck. Huh. Uh, yes, I see. Yes, I also see. All right. You please, sword guy. Just. All right, yep. That's uh that's exactly what I wanted you to do. Yeah. Come on. Please. Oh, I see. Oh, well. The sword guy, that's what happens when you don't grab onto the ledge like you're supposed to.
Uh. So what's this up here? More wind room. See, we don't wait. So it's never gonna line up right. Alright. You. Can you pick up the bug instead of rolling past it, sword guy? Yes. Fascinating. Guy, what's thou please just do the things right? Uh. Spooters. Please pick it up. Nom, 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 nom. Pizza Heart. What? Let's do that again. Hold on. Let's just roll it back. It's fine. It's fine, sword guy. I too like to roll into things that aren't there. It is one of my favorite pastimes. Really, you can't you can't jump up that high. Come on, sword guy. Fucking Majora's Mask sword guy can adventure circles around you, buddy. Key to free the monkey. Alright, mini boss. That doesn't get mini boss music. Of course. Let me just run over and pick up one of these bomb substitutes. Let me just go over and pick up another one of these bomb substitutes. We did. We we done. We good. And I have the monkey. Should I push the button? Alright, coming along, monkey. 
What you have in here? Yeah, two whole dollars in here. I'm not currently certain how a third monkey is going to help me. But, you know... Alright, fine. Can I get this one all the way over there? Like, up and throw? Sure can. So, what do we have in here? Do we have room where monkey is useful? Oh, we have another monkey. Yep, you're a monkey, all right. Alrighty. Oh, I see. Yes. Oh, give me the box. I got the key. That was easy. Oh no, it's a little tile guy. Uh huh? aren't gonna do anything with those tiles just gonna sit there okay what's in this box 20 bucks ah just torches that need to be lit okay I can light torches e. torches See, you got me, sir. Hoisted by uh, your petard. Just leave, monkeys. I suppose there's any way for me to put out torches right now, is there? I think I'm gonna need the boomerang for that. Anything else I'm missing in here? No, it doesn't look like it. Let us leave, monkeys! Party of monkeys. Yes, yes, going this way. Because with our light party of monkeys.
We can monkey bridge. I ho monkeys. Up, oh, the door is locked. Actual mini boss time. Oh no, the boomer dang. Don't you pat your butt at me. Hey buddy, how's it going? Beat that ass real quick. <laughs> Buddy, you need to stop being so terrible at this. Okay, come on. I've I figured out this dude's thing. I've I've done the three. I by right should have defeated him by now. Ow, my bum! Ooh, bug. Get your ass out and the rest of you out of here. Taking your shit. I am the fairy of winds who resides in this boomerang. You have freed me from evil and I now have my true power back. Please take it with you. Use it to aid your quest. And may both my power and my blessing go with you. If you focus power in your boomerang before releasing it, it will unleash the power of wind, aiding you in unforeseen ways. You got the Gale Boomerang. This mysterious boomerang houses the Fairy of Winds. It sucks things up with a gale force. On the item screen, set it to the buttons while holding the button. Use DR to lock on the places where you see this fucking mini triangle thing. Lock on to as many as five targets at once. I bet even the monkeys should be satisfied now. Okay, let's continue combing this place. We already found something good, so let's keep searching places we haven't looked yet. Okay, but first... Uh, we put that there. We put the boomerang there. Bada big, bada boomerang. Alright. And we make it go spinny. It opens a little bit. Are you fucking kidding me here? Do I really just gotta do this a bunch of times? Like, okay. Why? Why did I have to do that? Did you just assume that I did it the first couple times as like a fluke? All right, so now we can
Save another monkey! Poke, poke, you're dead. Monkey. Well, I guess there are still some monkeys you haven't freed yet. At this point, you should just save them all and see what you can get for it. Ooh, yeah! Oh, for fuck's sake. Just hit the bats. So there was something I wanted to check in here, because I'm going to take a stab in the dark here and uh, guess that with the boomerang I can put out torches and get that box I saw. And yep, these guys also don't like the boomerang. And there we go. I don't need to kill you guys. Alright, Box, what do you got for me? It's another Pizza Heart! It's just pots up here? Yeah, it's just pots up here. deal with you. Huh. Suspicious, but I don't think there's anything I can do with it right now. are just in place here. Make that come down. Oh, what do I find in here? We find the compass. Well, if it isn't something useful. As long as you have that, you should be able to find where the captured monkeys are, right? I mean... Sure. Let's see. Map. Yeah, I just go back to that other path. Something else under these stairs. I think there is. Not that. You bombable. You look bombable. But there's no... No fake bomb. Oh, there's a fake bomb here. Okay. And what do I get for my trouble? Is it money? It's money! Oh, 
don't want to deal with you right now, plant. I have a gate to open. I'm also just now noticing there's a pattern on the ground. So it's bam, 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 bam. Except it didn't do. How about wham, bam, thank you, bam. looks like it contains a boss key. Is this a boss key? Sure is. We got ourselves a boss key. Don't know why I brought that accent out forward. I just did. Yes, monkey. Where this is the way I'm supposed to go. Come on. Out of the way, let the hero do his job. And we throw the boomerang at that. We throw the boomerang again while we're on it. These Bacoblins, who apparently couldn't perceive us until now, decide to attack. Alright. Okay. See, monkey is up there. Let's go, monkey. Uh, 
Oh, yeah, this one. Oh. Come on. Climb. Anything useful to get from these pots? Apparently even getting these pots is uh, a bit of a question mark. Small key. We don't have any small keys, do we? Monkey Toad Choir. Looks like there's still two monkeys missing. I guess in order for us to check the temple out completely, we need the help of the monkeys. Ah, oh, well, let's help the rest of them. And that was the plan. Sir? That was rude. Trying to fight you on even ground. You just decided to be a dick. noises you're making here, sword guy. Hello, Mr. Bacoblin. You know, that is one thing that's kind of getting me, is how my first press of the sword button is solely for drawing the sword. I have to make sure that it's drawn... Otherwise, I won't, like, I won't actually, like, go to fight something. Instead, I'll just aggressively pull my sword out at it. What is this camera angle for? Hello? Yeah, uh, I remember this. What? Did you spin around? Take that, to that. Um... I guess that works too. Whatever. Open box. We get a key. Now, that, and that. My god, it's magic. Pardon me. health do you have? Damn. What? Sorry?
absolutely fascinating. Oh, hey, look. It's someone for me to ban. Ah. Oh. Bods got to it first. <laughs> okay, can you can you just bring me that? Hello, monkey. Are you sitting on anything? Two dollars? Oh, ten dollars. A couple more for the road. But no, why do they have unlimited HP when they're on the ceiling? But as soon as I do that... Two hits. So they're not even losing any HP when they're on the ceiling either. Let's just drop down. Come on. Throw the boomerang. Can we go back now that we have the small key? shall find the final monkey. for me once. Open up, Bunky. Was I supposed to do it like that? Oops. 
All right, so I was definitely not supposed to just free the monkey from down there, but I did. Come around here because I wanted to box. You found the stamp for the Hylian letter N. Check out your stamps on the collection screen. This some uh this some Wii U bullshit functionality, ain't it? I, am I supposed to take that N stamp over to, like, the B-verse or something? <laughs> Alright. And we have the final monkeying. <laughs> well, I mean, let's be honest. You've thought about it more recently than Nintendo has. And monkeys! Thank you, monkeys. Ooh. Hello, fairy. Why don't you slip into something more bottle? It even happens on boss doors. Although, at least it's not like Skyward Sword, where I have to figure out the way that a fucking 3D key fits into the lock, because... Woo, Wii Motion Plus! You can spin it any way you want! A spider is standing on air. Or fake bomb thingy. Arrgh! Baba. Alright, well, I mean, let's just take that and that. We're a little early to be fighting a Dodongo, aren't we? Alright, well, that's it. Good boss, everyone. GG's. Why would its eye be in its mouth? That's a horrible evolutionary decision. Okay! Yes, thank you, big monkey. Wham! Come here, buddy! Oh. Ew. to try to pee on me. Oh. 
Oops. I pushed wrong button. Alright, and then... Ah, uh, well... Alright. Once again, come here, buddy! Guy. I've had Queen Goma put up more of a fight than that. You didn't even make me do it three times. Drop a shoulder pauldron. Hehehehe, <laughs> well done. That's what I was looking for. That's a fused shadow. It's what the light spirit called dark power. Do you remember what that spirit said about how you had to match the power of the king of shadows? Would it really be this easy? Is this all there is to it? There's a total of three few shadows. I think the other light spirits have the rest. If you want to know exactly what few shadows are, well, maybe I'll tell you if you find the other two. I guess you'd better do your best to find them, huh? So let's not waste any more time here when we could be looking for the other two. I'll get you out of here. You pick up that heart container that fell out of that thing. Yeah, get it. Dang, yeah, let's get on out of here. Wanna go outside? Are you all done here? Yes. What else could I possibly have to do in here? Yes, let's save. Heroic Sword Guy Do not think that Hyrule is now saved from the spread of twilight Leave these woods and go to the east where you will find the land protected by the spirit Elden. There you will find those you seek. But know that these lands lie in twilight. They are now a dark realm covered by the clouds of dusk. If you set foot beyond the curtain of twilight, you will revert to your beast form, so be prepared. Hero chosen by the gods, leave these woods and go to the east, to the land of Elden Ring. That's better. Searching should be much easier now. But of course, you feel the need to go out to go help the other light spirits, don't you? Well, don't worry. When you turn into a beast again, I'll take good care of you. The first thing you need to do is find the land covered in twilight. Once you do, I'll help you out. See you later. Okay, so... Horse? Poop fart! Nothing happens. 
I was unable to poop nor fart. These are truly dark times. I wish I could have poop fart, but the game said no. I mean, I suppose it's always possible something happened to poop fart. Anyway, to the east. black wall ahead that blocks the way. I thought I would deliver a few letters, but it seems impossible. I am the honorable and dependable letter carrier known to some as the postman. Now that I have introduced myself, please take this letter and read it at your leisure. To read a letter, press down to open the collection screen and then select the letter. You can do that to read any letters you receive. Do it whatever you see fit. <laughs> do it whatever you we fit. Um, well, my business is concluded. Onward the, to mail. <laughs> okay. There's... If I have a letter for you, I will approach you at high speed. Please do not flee. I just need to do what, you know, what angels do. Just shout out. Fucking be not afraid. And then they'll proceed to be afraid. Yes, the biblically accurate postman. Hey, it's much closer than I thought. You remember, right? You know what this is? If you set foot in there, you might be a wolf again for quite some time. Or at least as long as it takes for you to save the light of Elden from Twilight, anyway. So shall we see the light spirit of Elden? Yeah, let's, uh, let's make it happen. I'll let you into the twilight? Yes. <laughs> and there we go. We are Doge again. That's a good boy! Now you need to listen to what I say from now on. I've been listening to what you've been saying this entire time, but not. Oh, look, how lovely. The black clouds of twilight are so fetching today. I feel so much more at ease here. You look so much better like this than, those dust than in those dusty old clothes anyway. So let's get going.
a thing in the road. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just. You learned the youth scent. See, isn't being a wolf more convenient? Now use X to hone your senses. You've begun to reawaken as a wolf, I think. Yep. Follow your nose! Wherever it goes! Look, God damn it. That's strange. The bridge is gone. Look if this is the work of those shadow creatures. Ugh, what a pain. Ah, uh, well, let's look for it. You, get me your map out. The yellow arrow marks where we are. You knew that, right? Whenever you destroy those creatures from the darkness, a portal opens that looks like this on the map. You hear me? It's called the portal. You better remember that. And in those woods we came through... Yes, it's gotta be around there. I'll use my power to take you to the location of the open portal. Pick where you want to go. Fast travel system! Ow! See, I told you, we're here. You know, most people can't leave the twilight that easily. You better be grateful. It's your job to look for the bridge. Look hard. Let's see. It might have actually been at the other warp. Wow, it's perfect, don't you think? What do you think? Should we take it? So, bridge, take two. Wow. Well, I guess the bridge just got thrown clear off into the forest and somehow didn't get destroyed. See, just as I thought. So, isn't the power of Twilight amazing? Call me if you need the power again. It should help you find what you're what we're looking for, don't you think? Alright, let's keep going. Aru Oh yeah, that's right. I should just be following the map. Follow your nose! Wherever it goes. I'll never be able to finish the fucking commercial quote. Huh? What are they doing there? This is a pretty elaborate gate. What are they trying to keep in? Or out? I bet it'll be worth our while to dig in. Yes, we dig. 
Hello, I am Doug. Carico Village. Ah, uh, yep. We'll open up a portal here. Come on, guys. I, I, I need you all over here. That's that's the gimmick. I need you to gather. Come on. Over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Who's a good Eldritch Horror? Come on. Come on. You guys maybe want to... They just legitimately don't care about me. Come on. Can I... That was a stupid situation to have to use a fairy in. Can I please just get you guys to... Oh, I think I understand. Fine. Fine. I get it. We kill you. I said, we kill you. Then you'll follow me over here. Possibly. Hello? Hey. Oh, hello, light ball. To the hero who was transformed into a blue-eyed beast in the realm of shadows in twilight. This way. Uh huh. Wait. Right. I am a spirit of light. Hero chosen by the gods. Look for my light. Gather the light stolen by the shadows into this. Alright. We got us another little bean pod. Yep, uh-huh. The insects of darkness. They are the form taken by the evil that attached itself to my scattered light. In this shadowy twilight, the shadow insects are invisible, much as the people from your light world are. With the last of my power, let me mark your map with the locations of the tears that have turned into shadow insects. But be careful, the darkness now hunts you. Okay. So let's see here. Hey, you can climb up here. Sure can. That. My senses are picking up a cutscene. Cripes, I don't see those black brutes anywhere. They've got to be hiding somewhere, waiting for their helpless little prey to come out. Then they'll feast. 
We are safe as long as we remain in here, child. Be at ease. Oh, yeah, I wonder if the monsters out there agree with you. They should not seem impressed by my bombs. How long do you think we can hold this sanctuary against beasts that strong, huh? Once they attack, it's over. Remember the lady from the general store? Just one of those things attacked her, and a whole gang from town went to save her. What happened? She was already gone, and there were two monsters waiting. You connecting the dots? That means if we get attacked by them, then we'll be... Bart! Oh, look what you did, wife beater. Look, Renato, all I mean to say is that it's risky here, too. Ain't you got some place we can hide? There is a cellar. <laughs> Beth? What? You've got a cellar? Where's the entrance, man? The entrance to the cellar is designed to open when all of the candles have been lit. I would not do that. My father instructed me to secure the cellar. I saw insects like the beasts outside. Don't cry, Beth. It'll be okay. Sword guy is coming to save us all. I can feel it. <laughs> These kids knew you'd come to save them. What a hero. How sad to be right in front of someone and not be noticed at all. You are chosen by the gods, and that only keeps you from turning into a spirit, or worse, into a dark monster when you enter the twilight. And no one knows what you've done. You may be doomed to toil in obscurity forever. You're the type to worry about everything, I can tell, but don't fret over Princess Zelda. She chose the state of affairs, after all. Anyway, what's with having to light candles to get to the basement? Not very subtle, is it? So, what are you gonna do now, my lonely little hero? <laughs> Awu. Candle. 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 What sorcery is this? The entrance to the cellar opening on its own. Could those beasts have engineered even this? I'm down. Good dog. Bugs. The light. We dig. We find a dollar. We get more light. We dig. about that? Looks like you can climb the scaffolding. Whoosh! The graveyard! Oh! No light here. Bomb shop. Burn. Burn. 
Still open boxes, Doug. Alright, well, killed the dudes in here. our way out. I can't just open door. Not that smart of a dog. Hey, money. Well, it certainly doesn't seem like a way out. It's just the way I came out. Gotcha. And annoyingly, it looks like they're all inside of buildings here. Box get light. Done with your errand. Well, let's get out of here. Well, that was quick. lead to more fun shenanigans. Maybe. Just maybe.
Alright. Drop down yet. Akariko Hot Spring. Well, it's, uh, not a very good hot spring at the moment. Alright, there's got to just be away right here though like maybe like this no you sure game you sure I can't just up through that. All right. So did I just have to do it twice or what? Flammable lantern strictly prohibited. All right. I shan't use my lantern. Hello, bug. the bug that's in there. Got six more to find. Go in here. Is that what happens? you do? Sorry, but as romantic as this is, I'm not going to stay here with you. I'm getting out. Yep, just, just blow up the whole place. That's a perfectly sensible way to kill these bugs. Hmm. I don't suppose there's any nicer way to hunt these things, huh? Well, you have to sacrifice someone's house to find tears of light, but that's how the cookie crumbles, right? Alright, and it looks like the last three are down. These of a. Dog, please stop. Looks like the path's impassable, but I can get you up it if eh, if you want to go. Hey, it's a go ran. Ugh, why do I have to stand guard? The ladder is destroyed, so it's not like any humans will come up. What's with the elders? If we have a problem the humans can help with, we should ask. It is, it is better than suffering for the sake of pride. Well... Hard me. You are not the bugs I'm looking for.
by these geysers. Ow. Fuckers just sitting here. Not quite. Oh. down. Then we take out the other three. They're starting to get creative with these. I can't just bump into this. Oh, there we go. Aru! Can't climb, can't climb. Come on. Mr. Goron, make the stop. Why do I have to stand guard at a dead end at the bottom of a cliff like this? Wait a second, have they tucked me out of the way because they think I'm useless? That would be awfully Japanese. Stick you in a menial job. Just stick you in the doing nothing room. Oh, come on now. It's hot. Another fumarole and. Once again, it's the worst possible place. I suppose this path is impassable now. Bird? Bird's all the way over there. Bean is complete. The vessel of light is full of tears, and light has returned to this area. And I am 
I'm not Doug anymore. Uh, I was just starting to have fun. Don't forget that fused shadow. See you later. spirit that guards these lads. O oh, great hero chosen by the gods. The dark power you, you seek lies in the sacred grounds of the proud mountain dwellers. But already those grounds have been defiled. Raped in shadow and seated with evil. You must go to those sacred grounds and cleanse them. Yay! Thorn guy? <laughs> it's all the little shits. Haha, <laughs> see Beth, I told you sword guy would save us. You are the one from... Ordem, who, whom these children spoke of? We are well met. I am Renato, shaman of this town. And this... This is my daughter, Luda. The beast took us and left us to die, but Mr. Renato found us. First, I couldn't believe they had come from so distant a place as the Ordona province. Yeah, I... we don't remember much. All of a sudden, everyone was captured, and then until now, it's been like... A nightmare. Yeah, it was like a terrible dream, and we couldn't wake up. Hmm. Nightmares are everywhere these days, it seems. This village has certainly seen its share of recent hardships. The dark beasts attack, but even worse was the sudden and inexplicable change on in the mountain-dwelling Goron tribe. They had long been our friends, but suddenly treated us as foes. Even now they refuse to permit us entry into their minds. It strains the limits of belief to think that such a gentle and proud tribe could change so suddenly. It makes me wonder if something in those minds is the cause of this change. In any case, you must take these children and flee this village before more nightmares descend. I, of course, cannot leave my village at such a time. There is no telling what may happen to us here but it is my job to try to coax the Gorons back from their recent change of heart. I don't want to leave all these people just to save ourselves. Come on, sword guy, can't you do something? Isn't there some way to make up with the Gorons? You think someone could go to the mines and do something? Uh. 
sword guy. Trying to go near the mines is very dangerous. I will be very sad to be separated from Colin and the others, but I know they must go. Please return them safely to their parents. I do not know what is in the Goron mines, but surely they will soon come to understand it and right what is wrong. Do not concern yourself with me, my son. You must flee this place as quickly as you can. Nah. We just march straight up to those Gorons and say, hey, cut it out. humans allowed. These lands ahead belong to the Goron tribe. The elder said no humans may pass. I mean, I pushed the button, but I pushed it again. A human strength is nothing compared to a Goron's. You understand me, human? That away with you. I mean, I pushed the button. Don't know what to tell you there, game. Button was pressed. Oh, you are back again, human? You will never pass. You cannot hope to match our brute force. Okay. So, Gabe, if there's something I must do besides just push button, you are not, uh, not being very forthcoming with it. Yeah, I think there's something more I need to do. Because, yeah, I can't fucking stop it. I, I think I got that done just right. So I need something else. Uh, how fortunate you are in one piece. I saw you heading up the mountain trail, so I was worried. Are you trying to reach the Gorons of Death Mountain? It's far too dangerous, sword guy. They recognize only strength. A normal person could never persuade them. But... I do know one person who was able to best them and earn their trust. His name is Bo. You may know him as the mayor of your hometown, Orden. Please go to him, and while you are there, please let him know the children are safe. Of course, getting them back would be best, but we cannot. But we could not keep them safe from the monsters on the road without a horse and cart. Please return to Orden and inform their parents that their children are free from harm. Give them my word. And so we shall return to Ordon. I'm not allowed to warp right now. Am I only allowed to warp when I'm dug? Ooh. Hope fart. Settle down there, poop fart.
That's the sound the horse makes, right? All right. Oh. You're not too shabby a wrangler after all. Won't this make getting back to your town a lot easier? I'll go finish your errand so we can get back. Get a move on. Hi ho, poop fart. Jump the fence. I never told you my name. How do you know it? Uh... Greetings, Mr. Sword Guy. I have come to deliver a letter. It is a letter from that fucking chicken thing. My business is concluded. Onward to mail! But, uh... I was so happy to meet you and spend a bit of time with you. I'm planning a trip to a new location, just so you know. If you continue your journeys, we might see each other again, so take care of yourself. P.S. I didn't have a chance to tell you this last time, but I have a son. I'll introduce you if we meet again. He's a good boy who can help you like an item, so be nice. Oh, I... I'm fine. I'm good. Don't need to ever cross paths with you again. Okay, thanks. Bye. Come on, poop fart. Circumvent the campfire. Mr. Mayor. Oh, poop fart. Get around there. Sword guy? Whoa, it is you, sword guy. You're safe and sound. Close. What happened to you, lad? So quick, inside. Uh, well, you see, I met this magic glowing monkey, and he turned me into a Link cosplayer. Well, that's good. Renato's an old friend. If they're in his care, then we can relax. No, oh, don't keep me waiting, lad. Tell me of my little girl. Ilya is with the rest of them, right? Oh, I see. That ain't what I wanted to hear. Ah, but sword guy. I guess I need to think of all five of those poor kids, not just my own. They're all in danger. What I should be asking is how I can help out. God. What's that now? Gorons of Death Mountain? I see, so Renato told you that. Well, it's true, I did defeat the Gorons in a test of strength and earn their trust with the help of a little secret. I can teach you the secret, but you can... But can you promise me that you will absolutely positively will not disclose it to anyone? Yeah, sure. Not like I'm live streaming or anything. 
It's fine. No one watches this stream anyway, so you're <laughs> you're speaking to the dark, just like me. Good. Alrighty then. Absolutely no one. Come this way. Sword guy, you've heard of sumo wrestling, right? Gorons like to match strength in sumo contests. Luckily for you, the basics of sumo are the same as stomping and charging goats. You want to hear more? Sure. Mm -hmm. Alrighty then, I'll teach you the basics of the ways of sumo. If you're rare, in, if you're getting in a sumo match, chances are you're in an arena like this. The first fellow to push his foe outside the arena wins. Step forward and grab your foe with A. Use B to let a, tr a retreating foe taste your open palm. Sidestep a foe's advance with the left stick. Three techniques, all of them pretty basic. Master all three, and you'll be showing, you'll be shoving folks out of the arena in no time, lad. So there you go, the basics of sumo. Need to hear them again? Rather than explain a lot, why don't we just get it, get to it? Come into the ring, lad. This is a Japanese developed game, you say? Fucking don't! Bitch slap! Butcha! Slap! Grab, grab, grab! Push! Hmm. You seem to understand the basics. Alright, then next time I won't go so easy on you, lad. Fight me as if you were fighting one of the Gorons. Too shabby, lad. With your natural talent, I'm sure you can take on the Gorons. You've gotten a sight stronger in the short time you've been gone, sword guy. Strong as you are, though, you can't hope to beat the Gorons wrestling with power alone. Those Gorons are made of rock. Uh, the secret to beating the Gorons is locked away in that chest. Take it with you, lad. You got the iron boots. Set them to set them to and wear them with the buttons, and you'll become so heavy, not even a Goron will be able to move you. You can probably tell those boots are made of iron, lad. Whoever wears them won't easily be pushed around, even by a Goron. If you're fixing to fight a Goron, be sure to wear those boots. Let's be square though, lad. You can't ever tell anyone about those boots, especially Renato. Sounds like a good way to get your legs broken. Just having those. Like, so you made your feet immovable 
And then this big ass Goron comes barreling down on you. Like, that's gonna slam into you, and your feet aren't gonna move, and then what? Your fucking legs just snap or something? That's like a great goddamn idea. <sighs> nope, didn't mean to hit that. I warp now that I got, you know, poop fart. Can't warp now. Fine. It demands that I ride poop fart all the way. Gave me a fast travel system and then just immediately took it away. I suppose we had to have some use for, uh... For old poop fart here. Not make this like uh, Majora's Mask where the horse exists solely as a key because it's nowhere near your fastest way to get around. It's not terribly far. Oh, come on, poop fart. I guess we're just content to just leave that gate up. Here comes Sword Guy to the rescue. Or he's just gonna get away. That's that's something that can be happening too. Oh my god, he is butters, isn't he? <laughs> Here. 
Hey guys, how's it going? How are the kids? You! Use bastard. All right. The tough guy, are you? Okay, it's fine, sword guy. It was just a dream. Boop. Can you... There we go. Turned around. All right, and then we fake out. Boop. Bye, bitch. That's just my general war cry, I guess. Sword guy. Is everyone okay? Good. Beth, I'm sorry. You know, for shoving you. Are you mad? Oh, shut up, Butters. I, I think I finally understand. I understand what my dad meant when he told me I needed to be stronger like you, sword guy. He wasn't talking about strength, like lifting stuff. He was talking about being brave. Sword guy, you saved me, didn't you? You, you can do anything. You can do something to help the Gorons in the mine too, can't you, sword guy? <laughs> Nod. Yeah, look out, Gorons. Here I come. I say that, but, uh... I think right now is a, uh, good place to, uh, end for the night. Ah! Uh, eight. So. Yep. Made some good progress, got through the first dungeon, got uh, through all this village crap. So. Just go ahead and save before I forget. Alright, so. Let's see here. So then... 
Uh, next stream is going to be as usual uh, Saturday at noon. We will be continuing Fallout New Vegas. Uh, next Twilight Princess stream will be next week, Thursday, uh, 7 p.m. Pacific. Where we will head up Death Mountain and uh, sumo some Gorons. So anyway, uh, thank you all for watching. Hope you have a good rest of your week. Hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.